The plate boundaries on the planet Earth are where we have the most of the earthquakes and the volcanic activity concentrated. One of them is in the Mediterranean Sea, where the African plate is in contact with the Eurasian plate to the north. African plate is moving northward. We had earthquakes in this area. What is interesting is that these earthquakes are concentrated to the north of the well-known Santorini volcano, which has erupted 4,000 years ago. And this area that is now the center of the earthquakes, and you see the swarm here, the magnitude of them, and here the depth of them, is related to what we call as the Colombo active uh, field of the volcanoes. These are at the depth of 20 to 5 kilometers, most of the earthquakes. This is the thickness of the earth crust in this area, where African plates going up under the Eurasian plates, it goes under that 20, 30 kilometers and comes up that blister at the active volcanic arc. But on the back of that active volcanic arc, we have also another extension zone. Strange enough, that is what we have. Santorini is related to the active volcano zone due to the subduction is a blister. But what is the Colombo uh, volcanic field is something that we call as a, a back arc basin is where the extension of the earth crust due to the subduction and here due to the movement of the Eurasian plate and the Arabian plate created a complex uh, structure here where the extension has created fault lines. Fault lines led to Graben and through those ones we had some eruptions underwater sea uh, uh, or sea volcanoes underwater volcanoes, sea volcanoes happening there. I will highlight that area. This is a Colombo volcanic chain that we have. Most of it, or almost all of it, don't reach the surface of the water. They reach and they get eroded again. And this is where we have this uh, uh, swarm of the earthquakes. They are something rising within an earth crust thinner part of it is not related to what Santorini is usually doing. If it was like that, we would expect the uh, eruption warning for all these red zones, tsunami warning for all these uh, other zones, and the earthquakes about seven and uh, so. This may be as a small eruption, even if it was Santorini, it will not be a very big one. The big one was happening 4,000 years ago, where buried these uh, you know, cultures in that island as we know it, and we can now actually we have excavated and found them in archaeological sites. And they are very interesting, I recommend we people go and see it if they can. We had some uh, la later eruption in that area, but not anything like that big one. The smaller ones are more pre predominant, but this one which is happening is related to the Colombo submarine volcanoes. Something like this under the water, you have bubbling uh, and gas and uh, uh, volcanic lava coming up, sometimes reaching the surface, some, most of the time getting eroded back. Uh, the highest one of these is at the moment is 10 meters below the surface of the water. If we have an eruption, it will be under the water most likely, and a small eruption, not very big. This back arc basin don't create very big volcanoes.